oh cool, I got all the quantum ripples. I don't think there were any quantum ripples for this episode though. I mean this act. something new. You should enjoy yourself tonight. You work too much as it is. I've been running tests on the temporal anomalies. I think it could be happening sooner than... I've we... seen when it happens. At least consider that maybe you misinterpreted something. Jack knows where William's machine is. I have to go talk to him. Martin can handle my speech. Martin. Sophia. Thank you. Given his limited time left, I also feel like he should be able to make amends with the people he was close with. Well, maybe amends is the wrong word, but... You know, I think I made the right choice, considering that I think he's gonna die. I know that sounds dark, but... You know, why waste it just like on this entire adventure if you're not gonna see the end? At least you get some personal drink? moment. I am mean, just not... I'm not really into drinking a lot, I guess. Oh. Mm. Rough day? Yeah. Yeah. Same here. Like what? I have things happen in my day. I do. Uh-huh. We had, uh, I had to deal with some internal affairs. Internal affairs? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're just gonna leave me hanging? Well, yeah, it's internal. <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> okay. okay, okay. Okay. I helped catch a traitor today. A traitor? Is that what all that commotion was about? Yep. Okay. That was me. Who was it? I mean, hmm? Who was it? <laughs> who was the... Who, who was it? Yeah. <laughs> I can't... I can't, uh... What? I am not at liberty to discuss this. Well, you just brought it up. It's like, uh, well, monarch drama. <laughs> yeah. But... Well, I guess, I guess I'm just gonna have to leave you hanging on that one. For real. This time. Well, I just thought maybe you'd wanna share it with me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna use the restroom, so... You hang in here, for real. Okay. Go mingle. Yeah. Drink okay. a little. Okay. All right. I can't tell if she's playing him or not. Like if she's trying to get info. What's wrong with that? Like, I don't know, is she terrified because she knows what's happened, or is she just disgusted by him because he's kind of a smarmy asshole? Hi. So. I 
think we're in trouble, and he doesn't see it. He refuses to. I can't imagine why. I know you and I haven't always seen eye to eye, but I know you care about Monarch. You care about what happens. And if we are reaching zero state, something has to be done. Then what is it we could do? You know what we could do. Truth is, Sophia, it's not really a matter of whether or not Paul will listen to me. It's that I won't listen to you. I find your approach to matters rather counterproductive. Filling Paul's head with your constant alarmism, distracting him with petty doomsday scenarios. I mean, if I'm being honest, I rue the day he gave you a modicum of function in this company. Because as you said, I care about Monarch. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to prepare for my speech. What is it that you're so threatened by, Martin? He's from the future, I think. Do I look threatened to you? I mean, there was the mention of how, like, you know, there was no records of him before when he was made the face of Monarch. What if Paul dragged him back with him or something? We have control of the presentation. Make it look good. I feel kind of bad now that I chose personal. That guy's gonna get shot. Damn, he is such an engaging character. Hey, you're Crocker, right? Hey, Crocker! <laughs> what a weird name. Crocker! I really need to take a shit. <laughs> oh, come on, Croc. Crocker. Crocker! Come on, Crocker! <laughs> oh my god. Looks like a nice body. Uh, over there. Where? The woman with the necklace. Mm. My money is on that. Mm hmm. It's a pretty good choice. Yeah. But... I'm gonna have to go with Ryan Gosling down there talking with George Clooney. Wearing his nice cufflinks, chatting about stocks. Yeah. Richard, where the hell have you been? Didn't have my invitation. Oh my god, you're always losing things. I'm not losing anything. Drama. Yeah. Wow. Uh oh. She's going for it. No. Bam. No. Told ya. Oh. Why am I losing you so bad? I don't think I can drink. drink. I don't think no, I can. No, rules are rules. Rules are rules. Rules are fucking rules. You owe me another sword. Right. A okay. sword. Okay. I'm doing it. Oh, I actually hate all of this. Oh, it's a type of drink. Thanks for your encouragement. <laughs> She's getting him drunk to reveal who the traitor was. Thank you. I just wish I wasn't losing so bad. Do you want to go for a walk? Yeah. Okay. Alright, ladies. I'm taking, so I'm taking mine too. Crocker, 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 Crocker. Hey, hey buddy. Crocker! Crocker! Burke! Crocker! Hey, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. Burke, listen. If I have to come in there, you're gonna fucking regret it. Listen, this is just a big misfucking understanding. I'm gonna be out tomorrow. I will put in a good word for you. I will help you climb this ladder. All I'm asking is please let me take a fucking shit. Go to the back wall. Thank you so much. Come on. Let's see. Oh, man. I know he's hey, going to try and break out, up. but... Back up slowly. Yeah. Oh! Frickity frack. That was badass. 
I mean, I knew he was going to try and get out, but I thought the other guy was trying to do something to him first. Damn, man, that was badass. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't really excited about going in the first place. Okay, why'd you go? I think, because somebody twisted my arm. What the fuck is that? Kind of looks like a dinosaur wearing a helmet. Yeah, huh. that's exactly what it looks like. I think that's the thing I was missing with at hey, one where point. Where are we? Are we even allowed to be out here? Yeah, is I'm that sure. the quantum ripple? <laughs> okay, all right. So what would you have been doing tonight if we didn't go? What, if I hadn't gone to the party with you? Yeah. Well, I would have canceled all my other really important plans. Ah. Uh, and then I would have gone back to work. I think maybe you worked a little too much. Yes. But I... Again? <laughs> well, no, I mean, I, I, it doesn't feel like work. You know, I like being wired in. Yeah. Makes me feel connected. To what? You work all the time. In fact, you're there most of the time I'm there. So, don't you think you work too much? Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I'm there. I guess, yeah. I love work. Hold oh, me right shit. there! Shit! Hey, you oh, little fuck! fuck. Hey, hey, All you had to do was let me in that perimeter lab! You turned on Monarch. What was I supposed to do? You have no idea what's going on, do you? I need to get in that lab. There's something in there that I need. The lifeboat protocol. You work with Beth Wilder. I've seen you before. You know her? She's the reason I'm here. Oh, the poor heartbroken guy. You broke his heart. Actually, a little sorry for him. Gun still necessary? <sighs> yeah. Come on, hurry up. You're a very kind person. Damn, they sobered up quick. I mean, I don't think she was really drunk, but he kind of was. It's right up here. Wasn't it? Oh, right. You, I got it, guys. I got it. I guess you guys can't do this. It's a special talent I have. I'm glad it's so celebrated. He's gonna trip a sound alarm. <laughs> You're welcome. Is this it? What is that? Huh. Seems he's not aware of the lifeboat. I thought for sure that Char Charlie Wilcock guy knew. What the fuck is that? Ooh! Life 
Dr. Kim. Oh. He was a guy. I don't know why I assumed it was a woman. Hi, Paul. The second machine. Where is it? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. into the past I've tried to change things undo mistakes only to find there's no changing the inevitable time is just one closed loop no matter what I do you and I we always end up here and no matter what I do time ends I think you've lost your fucking mind My mind is intact, I assure you. The memory, however... It's stretched. Like... You've seen too much. All of it blending into one. Apart from the few fragments of memories. One in particular. You and I, 11 or 12 years old, when we found that vagrant, you remember? And when I arrived at the past, that was the first thing I tried to change. I went to the roof, I tried to talk him down, but my presence startled him and he fell, same as before. Oh. Anything I try to change, it just triggers the same event. We keep seeing that body. Because we were meant to. I'm not turning my back on the human race. At this point. They're a necessary sacrifice. Is that what Will was? Necessary sacrifice. Will refused to believe the inevitability of what was coming. And he became an obstacle. Answer me this question, Paul. In everything you've seen, do I stop before you're dead? to cooperate I'll be here hmm maybe going for him was the wrong choice damn I hate decisions like this it's not a simple good reader. From uh, college and then here to Monarch. I was in uh, a bad place and he kind of turned me around. Got it. Sort of. I mean, it's, it's a ghost file. It's remnant of mass deletion. Somebody was here. We got the um, Cronin Field Regulator. Wait, hold on. Holy shit, this is Dr. Amaral's report. What is it? The stutters, they're... they're increasing in frequency. What's a stutter? The more frequent the stutters, 
the more indicative of a fracture. Okay, and what's a fracture? Of time. Zero state, it stops, and it doesn't start back up. And the LiPo protocol could save us. I have no idea. But the, the chronon field regulator, it is the core of Monarch's time tech. Everything is based upon it. And it, it has something to do with the lifeboat. We have to go. Wait. No, 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 no! This way, this way! Turn! Okay, so my guess... The lifeboat protocol is pretty much just trying to create a small area where time won't stop. Oh, he's ditching him. Charlie! Charlie! Wait. Charlie! What's he doing with the other one? I assume he was going back. Oh, yeah, he did sit on her. Let's go, let's go. Oh, no, he didn't. No, just, just stop. Well, that was peculiar. Well, I have enjoyed this episode more than the beginning of this act, and more than the first episode, actually, so I am going to end it around here. I think that's a good stopping point. So, thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed, please like or subscribe if you did, and goodbye, have a good day.